How can we prove that the derivative of the exponential function is itself? As with any mathematical proof of a derivative, we start by considering an incremental change in the chosen function and substituting these into the limit definition of the derivative. In essence, all we do from this point is simplify the expression. However, this is not the easiest of tasks. To begin, we can factorize the exponential function out of the numerator, and since e to the x is a constant with respect to the limit variable h, we can factor this term out of the limit. To simplify the resulting limit expression, we can start by letting u equal e to the h minus 1. This then means that we can find another expression for h by introducing logarithms and using the laws of logarithms. Substituting this expression in for h results in the following expression. However, for clarity, it is important to note that we are able to change the variable of approach in the limit from h to u as the limit of our substitution as h tends to zero is also zero. From this point, we can notice that we can rewrite the expression in the following way. And then using the power rule of logarithms, we can move the one over u into the power of the logarithm. The limit of the expression inside the natural logarithm has a familiar result, however it is not currently in a recognizable form. If we set n equal to the current power and change the variable of the limit to n, we can see that we obtain the following recognizable limit. This expression is the limit definition of e, which simplifies the expression even further, leaving us with the desired result of the derivative of the exponential function, 